and all of a sudden there was a big huge boom smoke came flying out and another boom and everybody started running and that a boston university graduate student is among the dead in the marathon attack and mayor tom menino vows we will not let terror take us over it's tuesday april 16th the day after terror at the finish line of the boston marathon good evening i'm andy bunker and i'm arden bromstein this is a bu tv special report terror at the finish line The president spent more than an hour meeting with victims and their families here at Massachusetts General Hospital, bringing the comfort really of the whole country into their bedside. Everybody we spoke to here on the streets, very happy the president was in town, as you heard. He departs tonight, the healing process here in Boston just beginning. At Mass General, Mike Neff for the Boston University News Service. It was very sober. It wasn't, you know, sort of grandiose or pompous. It was just a time for uh, for reflection, and uh, and I thought that was well done. And it was a pretty intense moment over there. Everybody was pretty emotional. Um, everybody was really sad. Um, I, I mean, I liked it to be there and be part of that for a minute.